Footsteps to Brilliance for parents whose children attend the Hollister School District. This video will give you basic information about how to use Footsteps to Brilliance with your children. Let's begin. First, your child will want to log into their Clever Portal. Once your child has entered the Clever Portal, they will want to click on the Footsteps to Brilliance icon. This icon will take your child to the Footsteps to Brilliance welcome page. On the welcome page, your child will need to click the orange tab labeled Super Secret Code. Your child's teacher will give them their super secret code. The super secret code will then launch the Footsteps to Brilliance program. When the program launches, you'll want to look at the purple sidebar. The purple sidebar has three areas that I think are very important. First, level one in red is designed for TK kinder students. Note, level one has a star. That means I'm actually in level one right now. Another way to know that I'm in level one is the fact that the activity page background is red, just like level one. Note, if I click level two, which is designed for first grade, it now has a star and the activity page background is yellow. If I click level three, which is designed for second and third grade, you'll note the star moved and the activity page background is now blue. Level one, level two, and level three are the areas where your children will spend most of their time. It's fine if you have a second or third grader that's reading at a first grade level that needs to use level two. It's also fine if you have a kindergartner that's already reading and needs to use level three. We know that children develop at different rates. This program is meant to help your child meet their needs, playing games, reading books, and writing. Please talk to your classroom teacher to learn which level they think would be best for your child. The next part of the purple sidebar that's important to look for are extension activities. Right now, my sidebar is loaded with summer extension activities. This area does change and is fun to check because there will be different activities that will be loaded here. Also, there are tutorial videos, which are short and extremely helpful to allow you to understand how to better use this program program to maximize learning for your child. Also, your child will log out on this sidebar. Let's look at the activity side. Every activity page, no matter whether it's level one, level two, or level three, has some similarities. The activity page will have my library, my games, and my writing and project-based learning. There will be more tutorial videos to follow that go deeper into the My Library section, the My Games section, and the My Writing section. Also, I will go deeper into what happens when you click the Switch Apps button.